Way back, K-pop. On lock, coo, us here with Mama Moo. It's been so long, coo, since Mama Moo. Baby Raj is tuned in. You ready for this? You're about to go full Moo Moo after this song. I've heard tale. Peppermint Chocolate. I like the name. Peppermint Chocolate. You familiar with that one? I am not. It's actual sexual chocolate. It was an homage to the song Sexual Chocolate from uh, Coming to America that I wrote when I was drunk and eating chocolate. Oh. Mm. Someday you guys can hear the whole thing. But that was the gist of it. Uh, it's particularly grating on the ears in homage to the band Sexual Chocolate. Uh, but yeah, this is featuring We Soon. Who's that? I don't know. Uh, and who I is think <clears throat> um, I might get them mixed up, but I think one, they're both singers, obviously. Right. The other but one's I think, K. Will. I think, yeah. I, so I think K. Will is... Uh, popular because he's on a lot of korean drama soundtracks interesting i might be he getting only appears in soundtracks no he's a singer he's got his own stuff but he's popular f- for that he's like on a lot anyways i might be getting him mixed up but i think the other one's an actor and a producer all right so we sung may just be the actor within the video no they're both singers okay 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 uh, anyway, I like the name. Uh, K. Will, I guess, get on with it. I'm, yeah. What was the last Mama Moo we did? It's been a little bit. I think it was a live. Don't, don't be happy with bu- with your bum key. Don't be happy with your bum key? With your boy bum key. <laughs> oh. pre-debut song. That's right. This is another. That was a great one. This is a, yeah, this is another pre-debut song. So it's going to be, I wonder if it's going to have the same sort of jazzy 1920s vibe as the previous ones. But I like it. They did smart work pairing up with uh, <clears throat> established people. You know, that's what you kind of try and do. You pair the old with the new. Us being old. Old men. And then we tune in with the new. The mama moves. The, all the hip bands that the kids are listening to. The snap, the snap on the fingers stuff. Do kids still snap their fingers when they're into music? <laughs> Why are you asking me? <laughs> I don't know. You, you watch, you know the hippity hop. You know uh, the Hollywood angle. You're, I don't know. You just seem hipper to me. You got the glasses on. It makes you seem authoritative. But I'm the o- I'm the older one. I'm the eldest. So yeah, but you know you how should, it is sometimes. You should know. I've been ancient soul like if you were asking me about something from uh beethoven's ode to joy it's not even beethoven is it i take it back i know nothing literally no era do i have a definitive uh worthwhile opinion on anything but we're working on that that's why we're here enjoying these fantastic songs if it's your first time just a couple of guys happen upon k-pop k-pop music and uh Enjoy the ride. Checking it out. And Mama Moo is one of our favorite bands. So excited to check this out. Let's see the pre debut K Will featuring Wisson. Mama Moo Peppermint Chocolate. Boom. <laughs> Hold the phone. Well, let's go with this. Like, bigger like just say, when do you 
There he is, we soon. Yeah. They so, blocked off their faces. So Mama Moo doesn't have any, they don't have any bad songs. Nope. Although Not a one. We have a w- long ways. That we've ways run into. <laughs> we have a long ways to go, but that was great. Yeah, I loved it. Uh, I had a hard time recognizing. I recognized Sola, <coughs> but other than that, they're so young and kind of They're younger. Different. I was having a hard time uh, pointing out. Really? Who was who, yeah. Okay. Okay. But, it, yeah, it was a super catchy song. I like the video and style. You definitely caught them during their parts. Their voices pierce through. Who I think is either Sola or Moon Buell. Moon Buell. Uh, but I don't know. I don't know that well. Still got a lot of learning to do. To being, to hearing out the voices. But yeah, very catchy. I love their pre debut, just set them up for such an awesome rise. Like everything that came out that is exactly the kind of music that even coming from the US introduces exactly the kind of music that I can get behind. So, loved it. I do not know. Who's we sung in that? Who is K. Will? I'm guessing K. Will is one of the guys, but there were two guys at the end. Yeah. So is K. Will two guys? It's so K. Wee Will Sung. K. Will's one of the guys, and Wee Sung's one of the guys. All right. I Both think guys. I'm Which pretty, one was the one that uh, yeah. was dead and ate the chocolate? I'm pretty and sure. Came back to life. It's good though. Yeah. These girls. I'm so glad they're around. <laughs> You're so glad they're around? Yeah, they put out good music. And it's a style of music that you don't you don't hear that much coming out in the States for that kind of stuff. It sort of harkens back to an earlier 
Aaron style that I'm glad they're bringing back. That's a nice, one of the best things to me about getting into K-pop is that uh, styles of music that uh, are kind of dated around here and not in vogue necessarily. Mm. Yeah. You can hear, and they put out great new versions. Yeah. So it gives, gives me hope. It's a great thing. Great thing. Mama Moo, I'm never like, I'll always play it for people. Like, I'll be, because maybe some other groups, I'll be like, oh, they might not enjoy this. But their, their sound, the stuff that we know of them. Right. I'm always willing to like play it for other people and like, oh, they, they're going to like this. This is like feel good. I music. agree. I agree. It's very relatable. To everyone it's fun and it's catchy and that's what you want in good music that's why they came in do you think they um got an advertisement deal with peppermint patties did this song get commercialized you know moo's baby rashes maybe not so much we all know we think they should have they deserve the money It'd be a great partnership but did it happen I could absolutely see it happening. I don't watch a lot of Korean or foreign commercials from Peppermint Patty, but I can absolutely believe that this song made the cut. And they said, well, they already wrote it. This is easy enough. Or maybe like uh, the hotels that leave the mints on your pillows. What is the company that makes those mints for the pillows? It's always the same, like green. It's the... Uh... I think it's the the Gideons. The Gideons. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Goose done a lot of hotel crashing. Uh, well, strike a deal with them too, and it's not too late. Maybe they haven't come across it either. Mama Moo, because I know you watch this channel regularly, because you're self obsessed. It's sad, really, but you know we all need a boost from time to time, and we're always going to say positive things about you. Uh. Reach out, you know. They might not have heard of you. They might know, not know the glory of peppermint chocolate. And peppermint patty and peppermint chocolate can make some mama magic. Mama moo. So get in there. That was a great start to the day. I loved it. Uh, high energy, fun. And yeah. We're going to keep watching. How many more pre-debuts do they have? Um, I'm not sure. I think there may be one more, but this might be it. I'm not really sure. Let us know if there's a fourth one that we're missing. Go back and watch the Mama Moo. Look at the Mama Moo playlist and what well, we, we covered. We covered they two. They did pretty much the most recent ones. So this would be the third we went, debut we've covered. Nah, we went backwards a little bit because we, we hit their debut song, Mr. MMO. Right. Um, and then the, and then we, we've done two. Two pre-debut songs. All right. The debut and the two pre right, pre-debuts right. and now this third pre-debut. Right, right. Yeah. All right. So let us know. Fandom. We'd love to know. we love the likes, comments, and subscribes. If you haven't subscribed and you want to see more of this and other bands, I know if you're a moo moo. You, you appreciate music from all sorts of areas. Some people are very tuned into their fan base. Uh, but you guys are a little more open. So I, I love that about you. You guys are all very supportive, and you recognize good music is good music. And we cover a lot of good music from across the spectrum. So tune in. If you haven't been a part of it, check that box. Or I don't know what you do. I think there's still like a little thing in the corner that uh, you click on subscribes. But just a comment. Let us know if there are more pre-debut songs or what we should roll to next on the Mama Moo albums because we will eventually get to all of it. But it's a matter of direction. What flows? Where does the river lead us after this, us covering the final possibly pre-debut song? Maybe there's another. But what comes after the close of the pre-debut? Since we already covered debut. The immediate post-debut? Maybe. Maybe there's something better. You let us know. We love hearing from you. We love uh, checking out these videos. And we're looking forward to more in the future. 
we'll let you go for now because you got busy days. Coo ass K pop on luck. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.